We welcome you live to the SBC post-game coverage of the state championship game where it just finished up here at Westwood High School where the Westwood Cardinals took home the victory 35-32, to kicking the game-winning field goal at the end with three seconds left. Paul, you're from Westwood yourself. How do you feel about this win? Well, I mean, just we've seen the whole season. It's been a long time coming, and, you know, just watching this team week after week just utterly dominate everything on the field, we knew in our hearts that this was coming. Thank you, Paul. And coming over here to uh, you, Nick, you're uh, you're a Thunderbird, uh, born and raised. How do you feel about this close loss making it after making it so far? The Thunderbirds have not had the best success in the past couple of years. You know, last year they had two wins. The year prior they had one win. However, this year we've seen Mawa has had massive improvements. You know, listen, Westwood's a very good team. They were very they were very highly rated at the beginning of the season, and they continue to show that in their dominance tonight in this game where they are victorious 35 to 32, especially with such key players that go all the way from their offense, defense, and even to their kickers where they have that game winning field goal tonight. I do believe that the Thunderbirds will be back and ready to play when we play Ramsey next week. Thank you, Nick. I also want to ask you, uh, Robbie Carsis tonight, amazing performance, three touchdowns, 250 passing yards. What went, what went wrong for the defense? Well, I wouldn't necessarily say that a lot was too critical, but I will say that, you know, a lot of it has to do with the very strong Westwood offensive line. It's very hard to defeat that offensive line because of just how dominant they are. You know, they have such big guys that are on that line, and so do Mawa. But Westwood, they have, they have more seniors, and they are much more experienced. And that's what is very crucial to a lot of high school teams, whether people realize it or not, is how many seniors are there and how long have they been with the program, how loyal they are to that, too. And I think that the Mawa defense really just is – I really think that right now the Westwood defense just – excuse me, the Westwood offensive line just completely outperformed Mawa. Coming over here to uh, you, Paul. So, yeah, Robbie Karsich, like I said, three touchdowns, 250 passing yards. In what, in your mind, what really clicked for the offense tonight against well, Mawa? Well, I mean, I would just say, you know, they know that this is a big game. It's a championship game. The chips are down. So, and th this has really been coming into the making in the past three years. Robbie Karsich has been a three-year starter. And, you know, this, today this is the big game. This is, you know, this is what cemented is his career here at Westwood. So it's all been leading up to tonight. Thank you, Paul. We're going to take a quick commercial break. This has been the SBC post-game coverage of the state championship between the Cardinals and the Thunderbirds. This segment was brought to you by MLW. Catch the best wiffle ball action on the internet, on their YouTube page, MLW Wiffle Ball, and all of their socials. Also, they have a summer of stadiums tour is headed to many major league and minor league baseball parks around the country and look for play-by-play play, play plays call of the days after the first game of every series video posted on their YouTube. Thank you for watching the SBC post-game coverage. I'm your host, Eric D., joined by my partners, Paul H. and Nick B. We'll see you next time.